So the fourth bill of material that we actually discussed during our discussion on master production scaling is modular bill of material. So a modular bill of material is a type of planning bill that is arranged by product modules or options. It is often used in companies where the product has many optional features. For example, assemble to order companies such as automobile manufacturers. So, the purpose of this form of bill of material is to establish feature and option parent structures that can be easily selected during sales order configuration. The strategy of using modular bills enables companies to offer a wide variety of different products without having to stop them. The actual configuration of the product occurs at order entry time when the customer chooses the desired features. So we have discussed this concept in the last lecture as well as in the first lecture when we discussed assemble to order companies that here we are having actually more options, but less inventory. So that is the benefit of uh, assemble to order environment and using modular bill of material that we are offering more options to the customer, but we are keeping less inventory. So, but we are keeping the inventory of sub assemblies or modules or options. So company can offer a wide variety of different products without having to stop them. So more option, but less inventory. The actual configuration of the product occurs at order entry, actual configuration. When the customer chooses the desired features. So here is a simple example of a pump. So we are having seven different types of motors that customer can choose from five types of switches, four types of impellers. And of course, there are some common parts that have to be used, whatever is the combination that customer has selected. And there is an accessory that we are, uh, we are offering that is actually additional feature that uh, can be offered, but customer can opt not to select any of the options of the covers in this case. So product will work if there is no cover, for example. So this is SSV. Now the manufacturer could create a bill of material for every possible option. Uh, in the case of assembled water environment, as the number of options and accessories grows, however, this clearly is not the optimum solution. Often hundreds, if not thousands of bills of material would have to be made for just one product model. So the solution in this case is to use modular bill of material. Now in this case, in the same example where we are having seven types of motors and five types of switches and four types of impellers and three types of covers. So that is uh, 420. So 420 options are being offered. Now actually the customer can choose not to have covers. So we could have actually, in a way we, we are having four options for covers because there are three covers and the fourth option is that customer does not choose the cover. So that will become 560. Now here you can get another idea actually that by just adding one option, the number of combination has increased from 420 to 560. Just for the sake of example, if there are say eight types of motors available, we add another option. So it would be 640, I guess. So, 640, so 80 more options are there by adding one more feature. So we are just going to have a break for Namaz just to uh, conclude this point. 
So the product is a simple pump in this case. So we are, this is the final product. We are having seven types of motors, five types of switches and so on. So we are having 560 option. Yes, 560. So 560 is a big number. Total possible combination are 560. So there are two possibilities. Either we plan for 560 combination or 20 modular builds. Of course, this 20 is a better option. So product is a simple pump for removing liquid. The choices are seven motors, five switches, four impellers, and three covers. And the number of possible modular builds of material available is added up. This is 20, this 20. But when we come consider all combination, it becomes 560. So we could choose uh, any of the 20 modular builds in order to build a product. Now we are going to have a break of 15 minutes for namaz and then we will join again.